is no need to scream. I have everything that I need from you. You don't need to be afraid of me. In all reality, I am just like you. Just call me Jack. That's all you really need to know about me. And, well, the fact that I, um, uh, took your kidney out of your body. And that's why you're laying in this bath of ice. But don't worry. I'll make sure if your family knows you're okay. <laughs> you see, I used to be just like you. I wanted to be a college kid. I myself was going for my doctors. I wanted to be a surgeon. I wanted to help people. I wanted to help people heal. And now, since I'm this monster, I instead hunt down my next victims. And I wait for the right opportunity to strike. I usually like my victims unconscious so they don't make up a fight when I start to cut into them. But it's also easier when I make them unconscious myself. Like with you, for instance. Chloroform is an easy way to make someone pass out. And that's what I used against you. When you started the pass out, I put chloroform over your face. And then you're like a corpse. And I couldn't wait any longer. So I took the nearest, sharpest object I could, which was a knife. I brought myself. And, well, the rest is history. And here we are. Don't make a sound. Do you want your family to survive this night? Do you want me just to kill you right now and take even more organs for him myself for me to snack on? Yes, I already know that I am a monster. Yes, I know. You don't have to keep repeating yourself. Keep your voice down. There you go. Now. Let me finish what I was saying. I wanted to be a surgeon. 
And so my skills that I've learned here and there, I took it upon myself to use my set of skills. And now I use them to get my snacks. My favorite ones to get is the kidney. <sighs> the kidney. It makes my mouth water just thinking of that delectable organ that I took away from you. I can't wait to sink my teeth into it. But you're lucky that's the only organ I took away from you. If I was feeling a little bit more peckish, I would have went straight for your heart. And hell, I might have even took a pancreas. Just as a midnight snack. <laughs> And it's very difficult for me not to kill you in this ice bath you're laying in. But I'm going to let you off with a warning. A warning that I will be back for you. I will be back for you and your family. I am not finished with you. Not one bit. Because, well, you can see, I am blind. I don't have eyes. I use my other senses to get around. So, I will be back for you, and I'm coming for those eyes of yours. I could easily pluck them out of your skull, and eat them like it was a strawberry. to me, I could finally see again if I used your eyes. Oh, the sweet thought of me just sinking my teeth into your organs. I can't wait. Oh, I can't wait for that. I think your parents are waking up. Do you want me to pay them a visit? Cause I'll be more than glad to make them visit me and get a lot more comfortable with them. In hell, maybe even make them into my dinner of sorts. <laughs> oh yeah, I like that idea. I really like that idea. <laughs> Why don't you lay in this bath for a little bit? Cool yourself down. 
and take a nap for me.